Mother Mary Kevin was born Mary Teresa Kearney in 1875 in Ireland. By the time she was 10 years old, she'd lost both parents and her two sisters had emigrated to the United States. Maria Teresa went to live with her grandmother, Teresa Grenell. She was educated at the Convent of Mercy in Aklo, but due to her grandmother's advancing age, she left school at age 14 and went to train as an assistant teacher. At 18, after the death of her grandmother, she started taking lessons in home nursing and first aid experience which would prove valuable later on in her life. In 1895, she entered the Franciscan convent at St. Mary's Abbey, Mill Hill, becoming a religious sister in 1899 and taking the name Sister Mary Kevin of the Sacred Passion. She chose as her motto, For Thee, Lord. She felt strongly drawn to missionary work, and in 1902, she was sent along with other five sisters to Uganda in the company of Bishop Hanlon. They arrived at Munyonyo on the shores of Lake Victoria in 1903 and began their work under a mango tree. In 1923, she founded the Institute of the Little Sisters of St. Francis of Assisi, and by the time of her death in 1957, the institutions she had helped to found had grown beyond what she had imagined. Today, the Institute of the Little Sisters of St. Francis of Assisi has over 700 members working across East Africa. Their charism is preferential option for the poor, which leads them to work among the marginalized and the poorest of the poor of our society. In line with this vision, the Institute operates homes for the physically and mentally challenged, some in partnership with Leonard to share disability. These homes offer a vital lifeline to many children and young adults who are rejected by their families and communities because of their condition. The residents of these homes are offered specialized education and proper facilities and equipment to best help them to overcome their challenges. They are also taught income generating skills with the aim of empowering them to become more independent. As an institute, the Little Sisters of St. Francis strive to be self-sustaining, generating income from a wide variety of projects including agriculture and industry. Commercial bakeries are one of the most important means of empowering the residents of the Cheshire homes and rehabilitation centers while earning much needed income for the Institute. Alongside long-time care and rehabilitation, the Little Sisters also operate hospitals in which the community is able to access quality and affordable health care. These hospitals, operating in underserved communities in the spirit of gospel compassion, are able to bring vital services from vaccination to palliative care closer to those who need them most. The Little Sisters of St. Francis of Assisi also have a large footprint in the field of education in East Africa, from kindergarten to university. In this region, where girls and women are often disadvantaged in access to education, Mother Kevin schools focus heavily on the girl child. And amongst the alumni of Mother Kevin schools, are the first female doctor and first female flight engineer in East Africa. The Institute of the Little Sisters of St. Francis is multi-ethnic, bringing together people from throughout the Great Lakes region into its family. Bound together by their faith and love for Jesus Christ, the sisters work and pray as one in the spirit of St. Francis and Mother Kevin, emulating her values of gospel compassion humility and peace. As an institute, they are challenged to return to their roots and their founding charism if they are to remain relevant to the church's mission of evangelization and service. <laughs>